<clears throat> hey, welcome back to Fire Emblem 3, but I'm not allowed to spend any money. Last time, we almost did the chapter flawlessly, but um, I made a little mistakey at the end there. This time, though, no mistakes. Uh, no failure. We are going to ace this. Super hard, super cool. Nothing's going to stand in our way. Except maybe the plethora of mages on this chapter that are definitely capable of standing in our way. So, this is another indoors map. Thankfully, um, we don't... We aren't hurt by that too bad, considering our strongest combat unit right now is Agma. So, I mean... Oh no. Agma can't... Uh... Agma has to get off of his mount. Quote, unquote. Uh, the interesting thing is that these are some innocent prisoners being held in a prison cell, being shot at by some uh, jerks on the outside. It's quite simple. If we move her right here, the, um... And Wendell, say, over here. Uh, like this. Um, Dolph, I think, we can has the higher defense. Yeah, Dolph. We just move Dolph um, over here. And he won't take, like, any damage. He'll take one damage. No, no. Or two. And the rest of them won't be fired at. So, we'll end the turn. This map has a lot of goodies in it. A lot of goodies in it. They all want a piece of, um... The chest in here, and there are some goods. We're starting out by dodging a 10%. Cool. There's a lot of good stuff in the chests in this chapter. So, we're gonna try to get as much as we can. But we are definitely being fired at this entire time. I forgot about that guy with the javelin. Um, yeah, it's not the easiest start. I have to admit. Definitely not the best way to start this chapter. And there he's transforming. And then the mages are moving up. So... A lot of this map is rushing to go save our imprisoned uh, allies over there to the uh, northwest. Um, the other part of it is beating the living crap out of thieves who dare to think they're allowed to get goodies. So let's start doing that. Barst. Take advantage of the fact that the weapon triangle is not yet a concept. Good job. Alright, so you got doubled. That, probably not very cool. But what you did do is weaken that guy enough for a Miss Sheeta over here. Oh, what the hell? Tacked out? Did I mess up and only give her the Leaven Sword? Did I do that? Well, it worked. But I shouldn't have done that. Regardless, skill, speed, weapon level, and resistance! Oh, I can't wait for you to lose that when you promote. Uh, yeah, fun fact. Um, the promotion from Pegasus Knight to Wyvern Lord, you lose six resistance. Yes, you heard that right. Six resistance. But I digress. Iron Bow... This should do a nice amount of damage, because caster is nice. And there we go. 10 XP. Good job. Harden is going to strut on up. And he's going to attack with his steel sword and get a nice amount of experience. They really couldn't have programmed a turban in for him. He doesn't even have red hair. Ah, dang. Game Boy Advance games and their... Um, Game Boy Advance, my goodness. The um, gosh darn Super Nintendo games and their limited sprite uh, palettes. Alright. So we're just going to continue moving up. Um, worst case is we can use... Uh, um, shit. 
Words, words. I know words. We can use warp to save these people. But we really don't want to have to do that. So... Wait. And then, um... I think that's it. Yep, okay. Now those thieves are going to start getting away. Which is really the opposite of cool. But thankfully... We got two beefy dudes, and Macellan's name is too big to fit on the goddamn, um, on the, uh, name card. Alright. Yeah. Um, Boa's gonna... Yeah, so we're, all, we're taking damage, but other than my one slip-up forgetting about the javelin guy, it's manageable. What isn't the most manageable, though, are these goddamn thieves. And two mages. Thank God that dragon has decided to not move. He'll, uh, he'll let us politely attack him at our own leisure. Alright. Merrick. Agma. Alright. Marth, I actually... Yeah, we'll do that. Oh, no, 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 we're not gonna just wait there. Hold on, hold on a minute. Attack, Rapier, and this should be a kill. If not, Merrick can uh, help out, but he's probably, yeah, he's definitely gonna. Or wait a minute, he might not have enough damage. Oh no, he does, he definitely does. Alright, Marth leveled up though. Gonna be good, strength, luck, and HP. Thanks to that speed rink we gave him last chapter, Marth is looking quite fine. Quite fine. Alright. Running lower on Excalibur than I would like. His health is 20. Alright. We are gonna get more tomes soon. The boss here drops the powerful, um... Uh... Baloney tome. I forget how it's actually spelled. Ah, shoot. I, uh... Keep forgetting to uh, close out my tabs when I start recording because I certainly am very good at this, despite having done it for almost a year. Um, I believe his weapon level is soon to be high enough for uh, Starlight. I think it already is high enough for Starlight. Regardless, Agma, take down this thief. Good job. Ooh, unnecessary crits. You love to see him. He's almost leveled up. I think he's literally at 99, isn't he? 98. Mm, I'm sorry. Anyways, here comes Caster and then everyone else. Ah, yes, the um, not Mart squad. Close behind. I don't believe there were any reinforcements on this map, so we're free to um. What the? She did have an iron sword. Was I just not next to him when I was trying to attack? Am I just that dumb? I mean, I've done some dumb things, but I don't think I'm that dumb. But it was 100% only letting me hit that guy with the leaven sword. I might have just not been next to him. Like a moron. But regardless, let's watch, um... Like, uh... Let's watch... These um, clams in the middle of a pit get peanuts thrown at them. It was not the most graceful or intelligent way to make that reference, but I thought of it, and then my brain just could not keep up. It was uh, too complex of a joke to make. Alright. Deluna! Yeah, good job. Okay, after that... Oh god, he's opened a door! That is one spry thief. Did you see the way he opened that door? And let me get uninterrupted access to all the loot within after I kill him? Good lord. Alright. Let me... What is your st What is your attack speed? Five. What is Mart's attack speed? A lot more than five. Cool. We'll just... Mm, we're just gonna remove this guy from existence. Yeah, cool job, man. Got him. Okay. 
Not quite a level up from Marth, but he is now just going to walk in there and grab all of that loot. Hmm, excuse me. Harden. Oh, hang on. First, first of all, Agma. Agma first. Oh, Agma can get hit by... No, he can't. Okay, cool. I guess that'll be another kill for um, Marth. Or um, Merrick, hopefully. I would like Merrick to be able to get that. And then everyone else. Taking your sweet ass time getting to the fight. Uh huh. Running up. Mm hmm. There she goes. And there he goes. Good old Wendell. Okay. And then we end. It's the enemy time. And we have to watch Dolphin Macellan just get continuously attacked by arrows. I think we have plenty of time before they're in actual danger. Hopefully. Yeah, yeah, we got plenty of time. Those are the big, beefy armor dudes. They doesn't afraid of anything. Alright. And Boa's the one that's in danger. But considering Boa's the entire reason Book 2 of this game happens... I'm not sure I care enough to save him. Alright, player time. Alright, Marth. Open this chest. Oh, there's the promotion item for Caster. Hell yeah. Yep. Yeah, Merrick's gonna move up. Then Julian, I guess. I mean, I guess I also want him there. Yeah. Oh, wait, he's going to be able to get... Yeah, okay, never mind. Caster's going to get a chance to fight that armor dude. Nice. Um, Harden is going to move down. As is Barst. Uh, here comes a Wendell. But, like, over here instead. Then here comes Lena. Uh, Kaida. And then... How do we proceed from here? I guess we move Agma over here to bait out an attack? Yeah, sure. And there we go! Alright. Enemy phase. Yeah. The big armor dudes getting attacked again. Oh, whoa, what's happening here? Oh, go oh, wow, thank goodness. All that boring stuff just got skipped somehow. I, whoo, have no idea how that happened. Anyways, six damage. Six damage. Good job, caster. Now, yep, one of you's moving up to Agma like I intended you to do, you absolute buffoon. He has... Resistance. Unlike everyone else. He's cool. Uh, apparently that spot to the left had to be occupied. And now the bishops are moving out. Oh man. This is just too much for me to handle. Right, what is your defense? Your HP is 13, defense is 9. Attack of 22... I think that's enough, actually. Like, exactly enough. Let's see, 22 minus 9 is 13. Yeah, that is exactly enough to kill him. Oof. Man, yeah, let's, um... Wait right there. And, uh, Lena! Heal this poor child. Heal him up. Bloop. Wow, quick animations. I should not. I should stop overselling that joke. All right. Beyond that, medic attack with Blizzard. Yeah, you got this. Take him down, man. Nice dodge, and he is dead. Perfect. He has fallen. Nice XP for Merrick. Gonna want to make sure that Caster gets healed up. Uh, Wendell level to three! Skill, luck, weapon level. Nice. Alright, Caster is gonna move on up. 
Uh, Barst and Harden, I'm going to want to give this kill to. Alright. Actually, we'll do Kaida right here. Yeah. This should be fine. Actually, she might just outright kill him, now that I think about it. Ooh, a dodge! We are really good at dodging this chapter. Love to see it. Uh-huh. 32 XP. Ooh, an L-Fire! That'll be good for, like, Wendell or Merrick or, you know, all the other people that use spells. Okay. So now Harden... Barst. And we're gonna leave that guy alive for now. But Agma is definitely moving down. As is good old Julian. And everyone else, just stay where you are. Enemy time. Uh, oh, jeez. Oh, no, this is different. Going after Caster now, are you? You fool. Absolute buffoon. Oh, Really, not a buffoon. You're probably going to go after Julian. Yeah, but you're not going to be able to kill him, so... He's probably going to dodge. Mm, it's worth a shot. Okay. Player phase. Um... Yeah, I'm pretty sure Ogma can move into this Wyvern's range, so let's... Let's just do it. Weapon, equip, Worm Slayer, and wait. Don't want to overuse that. At all. Wait. Alright. Um. Fairly certain Harden can just outright. Probably one shot this character. Yep. Take him out one shot, Harden. Bam. You have fallen. 32 XP. Almost the level up for Harden. Almost. But almost only counts in horseshoes and hand grenades, so. Harden will get his chance some other day. Just not today. Well, let me make sure, where is this dragon going to be able to attack? Yeah, okay. Julian, wait. Julian is fine in this corner right here. But if he goes to his maximum range, that dragon's just going to breath attack. And that's bad. In fact, the fact that I forgot the dragon uses breath attacks and means Ogma's going to get hit is bad. It's, it's quite bad. Uh, anyways. Caster, attack! Oh, you can just one-shot him with the steel bow. Don't fucking get him, Caster. Ooh, god. He leaves no survivors in his wake. Oh, you had a thunder! That is useful for, uh, Caster. Alright. Wendell... We'll probably need to stick around. We'll probably just need to heal Caster like once. Alright, there we go. That should be enough. And we will end. Now, this dragon's gonna move out. I did make a mistake there. Oh, no, no, the Dharma Knights. Alright, now this is the scary part. Because I forgot. That this is how this worked. He might dodge, though. Alright, he dodged. I think that is very cool of Agma to do so. Alright, now this... This might be a little tricky. But, no, nah, actually, no, it's not. He's just gonna kill him. We're fine here. Or maybe not, because that guy's got a lot of health. Oh, he was a general. Oh my god! Marth! Calm down, please! Strength, speed, weapon level, and HP. Jesus Christ. Okay. Attack speed, 12. Attack speed, 0. So this... How much health do you have, Agma? 22? Yeah, this is pretty much... Unless, like, Agma's not strong enough to kill him. Which I'm fairly certain that he is. Alright. Do either of you have a damaging move I need to worry about? Recover and mend. Yeah, no, we're we're fine. Those guys are uh the distinct opposite of threats. Twenty-eight. Twenty damage, like he's close. But he's fine. 
Good job, Agma. And now your first level up as a hero. What do you got? Skill, luck, weapon level, and a vulnerary. Cool. It's a common level up bonus, the vulnerary. Alright, you are fast as shit. So, attack speed of 6. Uh, Barst won't get doubled by that anymore, but it's still not something I want to have. Alright. Kaida, move out. Harden, move downward. Uh, Julian can get right there. Marth. Chest. Oh god, that's useless to me! Alright, well. Can't win them all, I guess. Wait, is Harden even damaged? No, he's not. Alright. Merrick. He can move down. Caster. Yeah, wait right there. Have Wendell close behind. Then, um... Yeah, end. And oh no, they're going to attack the Armor Knight still. Uh... Mm. Chest. A manual! Wow. Finally. We can read. Alright. Um... Yeah, Kaida... Down. B -b Barst. A staff. Heal up. Aha, uh -huh, 14 experience. Cool. Uh, Julian, I believe, isn't in range of getting hit by anything if he goes forward. Yeah, Julian exists to get whatever the hell's in that chest. I have no idea what the hell's in there or why it's so valuable. Alright. We're gonna wait. Yeah, you're gonna move down right there. I should probably check this guy's... Yeah, he's not getting out of those, um... What the hell you call those? So, yeah, Agma. Oh, Harden, first of all. And then Agma, who really doesn't need to do much else this chapter. He's, uh, he's pretty much done his worth. And here comes Medic. Alright. Caster! Attack with the steel. Let's see how this goes. Uh-huh. Alright. Good job, Caster. And now, just in case they decide to turn on you suddenly. Uh-huh. And I believe that's it. Yep. Alright. Enemy. Oh no, armors! Uh... Th excuse me, sir. I, I wanted to kill... Okay, well... Alright, how about this? We have Ogma move down. Bars can attack with his hand axe. And it's gonna be good! Nice. 10 XP for him. Where is Harden? Harden is right here. And he is going to use... Uh... What's his attack speed with the steel? Well, that be a si what is your attack speed? 5. Alright, so we could just finish him off with the silver. An old Long John Silver over here. And goodbye, Bishop. Oh, I really need to stop being so atrocious at math. Yeesh. Alright. Lena will be able to heal up him soon-ish. Mm-hmm. Did I heal up? Uh, Barst? Yeah, I did. Wait. Uh, Merrick... You also can wait. Alright, as for you, Caster. Attack. Iron Bow. Fire away. Oh, wow. Unnecessary crits. It's my lifeblood. Alright, wow. That is a cock tease of a level up. Okay. So now we end the turn. It's enemy time. Oh no, the Armor Knight! You're just gonna heal him up? Alright, well... You didn't heal him to full, I don't think. No, you left him one away! Which means, unless Barst misses this 69... Okay, great, it seems we're going to be here for a moment. So, let's just... 
Uh-huh. Almost to a level up for Harden. Almost there. Wait. Mm -hmm. Attack, Levin. Oh, wait, that doesn't do anything. Wow, okay, so math, it turns out, is really hard. Wait a minute. I, I just have to move back and they'll come to me. God dang it. Okay. Attack, iron. Fire away. Deluna's counterattack. 11 damage was taken. Caster doubled. Nice. All right. One more level up of strength. Strength, speed, and HP. That was a great final level up as a hunter. 13 strength for Caster. Whew. That is impressive. Well, I guess we'll just end. Yeah, you're going to heal him up. All right. So he... You know What's his health? Yeah, maxed out. So here's how we're going to handle this instead. Wait. Never. Wait. And wait. Then we end the turn. And apparently that wasn't enough to get them to move. Fucking. Alright, fine. This is what I have to goddamn do. This is what I'll do. Jesus Christ. That... Getting walled off by healers is really annoying. Alright. Eleven sword, attack of ten, resistance of three. That's the attack speed of six. What's our attack speed? Eleven. Our defense is eight. His attack is... Nineteen. We have over twenty-two health. This is fine to do. Yeah, and they have no crit chance. Alright. Deluna's counterattack. We hurt. But it's fine. She got 10 XP, which is nice. And uh, Harden will prepare to... Yeah, he's just going to be able to loop around right here and now. Alright. Uh, fuck up this Bishop Harden. Good job. You are now eligible for promotion. Skill, speed, defense, and HP. Nice level up. I will definitely take it. Whoa, look at how balanced that is. 10-10-10. His luck is outright abysmal. Have I abandoned Bantu this entire time? I just fucking realized that. I forgot he was there. This suddenly I remembered Bantu. Uh, sorry, Bon Bon. Um... Let's, uh... Wait. Um, we'll end the turn. And then... Yeah, you're gonna attack Kaida again. Not too scared. Right, and then... Seven damage was taken. Seven damage was taken. That leaves him with seven health. Right? Yeah, seven. She could miss the 93. So, just in case... Let's move Agma back. Alright, attack with the Iron Axe. Now we'd have to use something a little stronger. Or, simply weaken him. And then Bars can get the killing blow. Yep, perfect. And then we can heal her up with Lena. And then, just to be absolutely sure that she won't die. Here he comes. Barst shimmying on over. 13 damage was taken. Died. Got the XP. Level 7. Strength, speed, luck, weapon level. And amend. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Look at the man. 11 strength and speed at level 7. Like... Now, this looks like I'm leaving her in dire conditions. All I'm doing with this is putting so that Kaida, like, in case she misses the 93, she would have to miss both 93s to die. So, okay. Very funny. 
Very, very funny. Okay. If I didn't heal with Lena there, Kaida would have died. I got a brain on me sometimes. Skill, speed, luck, weapon level, defense. Ooh, wow. That, that certainly is Kaida. Okay. So now with this. Chest. We got a goddess. A whole ass goddess was in that chest. I hope it was Palutena. All right. Caster can just run on down. We can try to get him promoted his item this chapter. I believe the night proof was in this chapter. It might be what's um, guarded by all those spear guys. But anyways. Enemy. Yep. Player. Um, I guess I could try to give Barst more XP. Sure, why not? Don't don't put him up against the boss. But yeah, Agma, you go right here. You step. I meant to heal. Okay. Whoops. All right, and now the final chest. Marth, what do you got? A silver sword. That is really good. Wait. Uh, Kaida's... Kaida can't promote for quite some time yet, so I'm not as hard-pressed to get her, um... Her promotion, uh, level. But I know for a fact you get the Knight's Crest somewhere in here, I'm pretty sure. Anyways, end. Player. Uh, item. Trade. Yeah, Barst. Get that mend. Item. Trade. Lena. Give her... The mend. Wait. Staff. Mend. Agma. Let's see. How much damage do you do, kind sir? 22. His resistance is 4. So what we do is weapon equip the killing edge. And then we wait. And we let him come to us. That is all we gotta do. Wait. Julian. Move on up. Yeah, um, what are these guys' attack speed? Yeah, there, there, there's, there's the Nightcrest. Oh, but they all have silver. Ooh, that's, uh... That's a little spooky. So even with the zero attack speed, I probably want to be able to attack the turn anything happens. Uh, did I move Caster this turn? I don't think I did. There he is. Uh-huh. Wait. Uh... And All right, here we go. You rebels who oppose Deluna, taste my destructive baloney magic. I know it's like Balganone or something. I've always called it baloney because I fuck trying to pronounce words. There we go. That sure was a destructive force, Volzen. Agma levels up again. Level 3, Strength, Speed, Weapon Level, HP. Perfect. Don't think you've won. Deluna will not fall. Erg. Player phase. Woo! Now, we just have to make sure that we're ready. Let's, just to be safe, heal up Agma. I don't think he'll be seeing any more combat. But I might need him to uh, be in range for when I open this door. Yeah. In fact, I probably will. All right, there's Harden. Wait. Who has the door key? It's you, right? Uh-huh. Wait. Uh, where's Caster? All the way up here. Wait. And we're gonna end the turn. Player phase... All right, make one more turn of preparation before we bust down this door. Um. Yep, okay. And then she will move over to here. Oh, why I, I have to manually use the door key. Damn it, okay. Mm-hmm. Wait. Uh, end turn. Okay, first step. Caster. Item... Trade. Get the Orion Bolt. Item. Use. He is now going to promote. 
from a hunter to a horseman. Hell yeah. Skill, defense, and move. However, he has to stay as a hunter because um we are indoors. However, he is now promoted. Yeah, and then Marth can seize whenever. So let's just... Door? Uh-huh. Yeah, you all have pretty scary weapons. However... Only Agma can reach. And he is a little hurt. Fuck. Attack. Steel Sword. 21 damage. What's his defense? 10. That's 11. Oh, God. Oh, wait a minute. Um, hang on, hang on, hang on. Um. We might... Okay, so we definitely cannot abandon... Uh... Whatever's in that chat. Well, like this. 100%, I have to kill this guy. Yeah, there we go. We have to get that night proof. It's just one of those things that has to happen. Or night crest, sorry. And then Harden is going to trade for that night crest. He is going to use the night crest. And uh, there he is. Whoa, Paladin. Wow. So fast. Uh, his class strength, skill, speed. Yeah, he gets. Paladins get incredible promotion gains, which makes it more painful when they're indoors and they don't get to keep it. So... And then we're going to attack the Hand Axe. I think this... 11... I believe you double him, right? You do not. Cool. With Warp, we can, um... We can get whatever's in that chest. But, uh, well, not, well, we'll have to, if we can kill one, the problem is two attacks on any of these guys from these guys will kill. So, like, what's, what's the plan? I could warp Merrick over there, and with Merrick over there, he can kill one of them, and we can guarantee whatever the hell's in that chest. Is whatever's in that chest worth a warp usage? It's gonna bother me if I don't do this. So... If this ends up being something really stupid... I'll just have to cry about it, I guess. Skill and luck. Alright, cool. Alright, now, attack... Blizzard... Yeah, your attack speed with this is 5. You'll double someone with nothing. Yeah, 22. Yeah, okay. Blizzard. End this guy's life. There we go. Deluna fell. 32 XP for Merrick. And then this guy can't reach Julian, right? Yeah, no, he can't. Alright. No one's in danger of dying. We end the turn. And we'll see if I was stupid or not. Yeah, you're going after Merrick. Not surprised. Here he comes. And he missed. Imagine missing. Well, actually, Merrick will be able to get another level up off of this. So this might actually be fine. Okay. Alright. Let's break open that goodie and see what's inside. Next turn, because this game hates me. Wait. Uh, attack. Blizzard. Behold the power of icy feet. Alright, there we go. What do we got, Merrick? Speed. Weapon level, resistance, and HP. Resistance! Holy shit! Nice. Uh, more speed is definitely good, though. And then we end. And then finally, was whatever the hell was in here worth a warp charge? Yes! Oh dear god, yes it was. Okay. 
I see now why that was guarded so well. But that does it. I will see you guys next time for the second half of the game. We're halfway there, and I haven't had to use a shop yet. This is turning out to be perhaps a little easier than I thought. Hmm? I just jinxed it. I know it did. I know I just jinxed it. God damn it.